morning everybody it is day number two in montenegro and jasmine and i so far are loving it aren't we jasmine yeah it's really nice we're having a great time she's got a really nice outfit on today i'm not changed for the beach yet but i'm just doing shorts and t-shirt i won't do the outfit the day thing it's kind of not my thing anyway so we're going off to the welcome meeting now this video i might give you a few little tips i'm going to start off by this one that i've just literally thought about when you leave the room if you try and leave that in for the electric, and it's the same in the majority of hotels, so I'm gonna guess the same here. You leave that in for the electric to keep your air conditioning on or your fridge on or something like that. When the maid comes to sort out this, um, it absolutely will be removed. Generally, they don't like it because of obviously their electricity and the planet and all that sort of stuff. So they will take it out. So if you wanted to do that sort of evening time or something, or if you've got medication in the fridge that you need the fridge, our fridge actually doesn't work. I don't know why. Probably have to get them to switch it on or there's some secret switch somewhere amongst their makeup oh, mess. Oh, I think you did say yes, it was available from request. I thought he meant mini bar. I thought he, he meant mini bar. might just fridge. He might be in the fridge because we've got two chocolate coins in there from Starbucks that we didn't eat because I wasn't very well. And I did put my aloe vera jelly in there, which is good to keep it in the fridge, but I don't think it's, I don't think it's cold. So, um, yeah, so that's my tip for now. Um, what else? If you come particularly to this hotel, oh, I don't know if I can show you the bathroom. I can kind of show you the bathroom. So down there is a drawer that's where the hair dryer is because we decided not to bring one because i said to jasmine ah oh, there's always a hair dryer we don't need to take one and then we had to go to reception yesterday and ask to borrow one and they said it's in that drawer so there you go we're going off to the welcome meeting so we weren't sure about the weather this uh, dodgy day isn't it jazz yeah. where it's going to be rainy but we've yeah. just come out and it's sunny she's had to put her glasses on i'm going to put mine on as well yeah apparently there's only going to be one little bit of rain at 10 but we'll be in the meeting then anyway it's all right can't see it happening. It's nearly 10 o'clock now. Everybody, I think I'm going to come and say before. Academy we just found here is where they play the volleyball we found a jet ski but I'm not sure about the sea and I might need Nathan to take us out on that the first time I'd be great at it. of course you would and I'd be great at it too I could take you on it but it looks like it might be done up for the winter because they're closing here in a couple of weeks anyway for the end of the season I'm not sure about the weather are we it is lovely but this, this is our worst day today apparently with the weather isn't it I'm not going to come back no it's not bad at all As we've just come from the welcome meeting, I've realized really the enormity of like trying to get as much information over to you guys. It's gonna be completely impossible to do every experience and see everything and give you every little tip that we think of. Um, so if you've got questions, make sure you leave them down there because then I will answer them if I know the answer. If not, I can throw it out to other people. We've got a Facebook group as well that you can join. There'll be a link down there. So make sure you come over and join that. Um, but little things like, you know, the hairdryer is underneath the, the sink and stuff like that. We didn't find that. And probably the way that the receptionist answered us, I reckon loads of people asked that question. So we'll do our absolute best. Um, can't guarantee we're going to cover everything, obviously. And we can't keep coming back to the same place time and again. Um, 
for lots of reasons really but people will really sort of look at us when we're filming and then if you come back a second time a lot of those people might watch the videos which is a great thing and but obviously you spend a lot of time talking to them and not doing the actual thing um anyway so me and my beautiful daughter are gonna go to the swimming pool we think are we swimming pool wherever we yeah and do some editing at the pool side which will be great <laughs> lunch um jasmine's having a little nap so i'm gonna sit and do some editing just to show you the weather it's like really nice it's supposed to be and um, this is like our worst day and then the rest of the week it's going to be like 20 something degrees so our lunch was over here and um, this place is called marley's and um, they do like pasta and pizza and things like that over there some nice salad there were some bits and pieces there that you could choose that were gluten-free um, I didn't double check if the fries were gluten free because often they're not, are they? They're all like cooked in the same fryer and stuff, but maybe they were. Um, but yeah, so there's also loose in there just for FYI. They don't have any locks on the door, so you have to choose one and hold it, but you know, there we go. So yeah, it's beautiful. Loving being on the beach today. And because we wanted to be quiet and get a bit of work done, which is this is work now, so this is me laying down and about to do some editing, um, I'm just going to do it on my phone and yeah, I've got lots to do, lots of catching up to do. So we have a new friend joined us. Hello, dog. Oh, you're gorgeous. I think someone got a bit hot, so he's just dug a little space. Oh, you're coming in under... Oh, there we go, look. This is super cute. Looks a bit like Rosie, Joanne's dog. Do you believe Straight from a party So Jasmine and I have been and had a really nice time in the sea. If you'll know me by now, you know it's kind of my happy place, a beach in the sea, I really love it. Um, but it's pretty empty, it's like no one around. Uh, we made friends with the dog, which is cute. And I think we might go get something to eat in a minute, mightn't we? But I need to kind of tell you guys, I've learned quite a lot. I think my makeup might be everywhere, Jazz, I can't quite see. I've learned quite a lot since we've um, since we've come out. So I told you that I thought this place is called something that I've now learned. It's called All Sing, that's how you say it. A version of that, something like that. To say thank you is something like koala. Koala, something like that, apparently. Um, if Tamara's watching this, she's gonna be laughing at me now because no doubt I've said that a bit wrong. And to say hello, you say ciao. Um, but I've tried that and every time I did, somebody frowned at me. But I do like when I go abroad to try and at least try and say, hello, please, goodbye, thank you. Um, because I just think it's nice. Nobody's mentioned anything about tipping here to us, but I always just think it's nice just to leave the euro on the table if you've had table service and stuff. Um, so that place over there served us our lunch, which was really nice, that was table service. And there is also an upgrade you can get here if you wanna pay for premium drinks and things. Um, but we're not doing that, it's no need really. We've got everything that we need. Um, so yeah, so good. And I also think that you can hire out, over there there's some barley beds. I think you can hire those out, but I'm not too sure about that. So we'll find out. What we did find out, oh gosh, it's really bright. There's two free a la carte meals you can have here in a week. One's an Italian and one is a steak restaurant. So we booked our Italian. When's our Italian? Tomorrow night? Sunday. Sunday, oh, it's ages away, yeah. Uh, and it's weird to think that we've only been here like 24 hours. Just stopped 
for a moment to do a little blog post um, of the blog post picture, sorry, I should say, of the. There's a dog. You right there, Jasmine? Yes. She's liking all the dogs and cats everywhere, right? Yeah. yeah. Such an animal fan. Stunning sunset, stunning daughter. Hilarious that they're getting ready for the evening and we've not we've not finished yet, that we're still like in daytime mode, aren't we? But isn't that beautiful? Yeah. Don't you love it? I do. How's your day been, Jazz? Really good, thank you. Yeah, really good. I don't think I need them on now. Just put them on top of my head. But yeah, so over there, we can show you now. That's kind of an amphitheater area where the entertainment is. In here, there's some toilets, Jasmine. I've just been in there and they are spotlessly clean. Good. You could actually be doing off the floor, but I wouldn't recommend that. So, yeah, this is the main pool area. Obviously, we can show you now because there's no kids. All the activities go on in this one. Just over there is a quiet one. Uh, there's a lifeguard that sits there between the two. And then, obviously, that you've got the beach right there. Absolutely cracking. It's worth me mentioning there are tea and coffee making facilities in the room, which is quite cute. And the sugar sachets are actually quite a decent size. The little stirrers are in these things. We've got Arabica beans by Shibo, English breakfast tea. And in the fridge, which adds in and on, we've got some UHT milk, I think. Yeah, they've only given us a tray, so we need to get some more, really. But yeah, sometimes it's nice to know that we have a bottle of water here. Make sure you top that up, your kettle there. And great telly. Here we are all ready for the night out. I've got this cute little dress on, which I'm actually going to wear this when I graduate in January as well, but with killer boots that come right up to here. Obviously not today. I've got the legs out and I am wearing stolen jasmine shoes and she doesn't mind um so yeah it's been a really really nice day really relaxing but we've got lots of work done well i've got lots of work done um but i'm very very behind so apologies youtube guys um i am behind but never mind so we're gonna go for dinner now it's quite late actually so i think we need to hurry up a little bit jasmine um we made a mess as usual holiday um so yeah looking forward to it and also looking forward to getting in this bed tonight I slept for a solid eight hours i don't know if i told you that earlier Solid eight hours last night. That was really good going. Um, and I was going to have my hair messy, but I decided against it. So we've gone for this little curly look as well. Um, so I don't know why I'm telling you all of that, really. From a party. So, yeah. Holiday, and you come outside in the evening time, don't you? Yeah. And you're like, oh, and even can you hear them crickets? I don't know if yeah, you can. Yeah, I can. So you hear the crickets, and you, you're at home. Like apparently, Jazz, I don't know if you know, yeah. it's supposed to be absolutely. It's not very good in the light. No. Without light. Hmm. Um. Yeah. Apparently, it's really raining at home. <laughs> um. Yeah. Sucks for them. <laughs> and the thing is, as we was packing, we was like, surely to goodness. We're not going to get bikinis and stuff on because we just couldn't imagine that it was going to be that yeah. warm. And the forecast wasn't great, but I was like determined that optimism in me, is that the right word? Was Optimist. Optimist. I was like, we're going to have great weather. It's going to be fine. Yeah. It's going to be nice and sunny and hot. And guess what it's been? Nice, it's sunny and hot and warm. It has been lovely since sunny and hot. So she's quite right. So yeah, but I like this of an evening time. It's nice. I've got sleeves on. It's almost like I'm too hot. 
So Jasmine has carrot cake for dessert. I'm not kidding, I know there's not much to show you, but this meal was amazing. It was like coffee kebab thing and I made some salad thing here. Um, that was pork and I should have filmed it earlier. This apparently is gluten-free brownie. I'll soon know if it isn't, but it didn't say it's gluten-free, but it's got signs that say it hasn't got any gluten. And then this is, um, I'm gonna say pancetta, I don't know if that's quite, that's not the right one. Panna cotta, thank you, Jasmine. <laughs> I still said pancetta and that was wrong. Um, yeah, so I'm looking forward to that little bit of dessert. The wine had run out, which is a bit of a shame, but we've got some water and we're gonna drink some wine when we go downstairs. I might have just made a fatal mistake, but we was gonna go into the Irish bar after our dinner, wasn't we? Yeah. And then I sort of thought, we might be able to hear some live music down there. So we're gonna have a little wander, but that's where the kids club bit is. So probably Jasmine will scream and run because she's not a child friendly person. I hate you put that really She bad. hates kids. I don't hate them. I mean, to be fair, the ones here are right. But it's just the ones that they've like, been really well behaved children here. I think maybe yeah. because they've got so much to do. It's just the ones that are like. Maybe it's just a reflection really on bad. amazing parents booking their holidays through Tui. Yeah, obviously. Hashtag no ad. Um, anyway, we're going to have a look and we'll show you when we get there. <laughs> We've left the entertainment. It's been such a mad night. Oh, thank you for the light. Such a mad night and so much fun that we're kind of like, it's done already. We don't want to be done. So we just come for a it's little walk. 12. It's only 12. Especially when we came out at night Should for we go dinner. Into That's true, actually. Should we go into town? We regards of town here. We don't. We don't know if there's town or not town. Anyway, so we thought we'd have a walk on the beach, but we're a bit scared about it. So we're going to come have a look at the beach. Have a look at the beach. There's all lights down there. What's that? That's just a restaurant. Restaurant? Oh, is the restaurant open? No. Oh, it's not open. Um, yeah, yeah. I don't know, lights off there. This looks cute. We could get some random photos for Instagram. It's a bit dark. Lou Life. Please don't fancy my Instagram. Links below. Well, we found a beautifully lit swimming pool and we can hear some music over there singing. Tonight's gonna be a good night. And I love that track, it's so good. It's really pretty here. Um, I've got some WhatsApp messages to answer, so I'm gonna go off and do that. Are we gonna turn in for the night, Jasmine? I don't think we're gonna have to. I don't really know what else is on at this time. Yeah, let's go and get some it's sleep. It's weird coming here after the last place I went to was Zanti and everything was open till like 6 a.m. Yeah, you was probably just going out about now, weren't you, when you were at Zanti? <laughs> yeah. so, but yeah, you wouldn't go out before this. Tomorrow night, I think, well, tomorrow, late afternoon maybe for dinner even we're gonna go to Olsing uh, the main town we're gonna get a cabin to there aren't we Jasmine yeah be a nice bit of adventure won't it yeah be fun so I am gonna bid you all a very good night it's been lovely to spend the time with you today I hope you've enjoyed the vlog you're dancing Saturday and Sunday please if you've enjoyed this vlog give it as always a thumbs up Jasmine a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already if you've come into the holiday village montenegro please send me a message and come and join our facebook group the links are in the description box down below and uh, look drinking water good girl um and i'll look forward to seeing you in my next video which will be tomorrow i uh, can't promise it be edited and uploaded tomorrow because i'm spending a lot of time editing um but this has been this is me <laughs> and that's her 
Hi. This is me. I am bruised. I am who I'm meant to be. Good night.